the question is from the following transactions of a concessionary account for the year ended 31st March 2017. Here, the basic concept when we are buying a machine on the date of purchase, if we spend something for repair, then that will be capitalized, added to machinery account for the purpose of depreciation. And after that, whatever we spend, that will be charged to profit and loss account as repairs. Hence, it will not be charged to machinery account. Then read the question carefully from the following particulars of a concern prepare the machinery account for the year ended 31st March 2017 one year only. Hence draw the machinery account and we bought the machine on 1st April 2016. Hence in the debit side April 1 2016 to cash account this cost of the machine 40,000 plus 10,000 repairs that is rupees 50,000. Usually people show twice two cash account rupees 40,000 then two cash account rupees 10,000 but we take only one amount in one go we add both. The next machine was purchased in the first oh, 30th 9, 2016. It is 30th September 2016 hence October 1 to October, November, December, January, February, March. Hence, we have to charge depreciation on the first machine for the whole year, for second machine for six months. Then come down and the repairs expenses on the second machine of rupees 3031st December will not be taken into account. If this repair on second machine would have been incurred on 30th September 2016 then we would have added it to rupees 20,000 and made it rupees 23,000. Now in the credit side on 31st March 2017 by depreciation account for machine 1 at the rate of 10 percent it is rupees 5,000 and on machine 2 at the rate of 10 percent for 6 months it is rupees 1,000 and the to to total will be 6,000. The machine 2 was bought in mid year, hence 6 months depreciation will be charged at the rate of 10%. Then 31st March 2017, buy balance carried down. This is on machine 1, that is rupees 50,000 minus rupees 5,000, this is rupees 45,000. Machine 2, 20,000 minus rupees 1,000 that is rupees 19,000 that is total is rupees 64,000. The total in the debit side is rupees 70,000 transfer it to credit side and we have not to transfer it to credit side the credit side totaling is also same 70,000 and write down two balance brought down on April 1, 2017 the same value rupees 64,000. This is the final answer.